Hello guys, it is me, Shelton83, and this is a how-to video of how to get in, I guess, an OP QQ bang. So, I will show you right here, I have been, um, experimenting, uh, that was my computer, if you heard that in the background, but anyways, back to what I'm saying. I'm here to teach you guys how to make an OP QQ bang of level 5. So as you guys see right here on your screen, I do have a lot of level 5 QQ bangs. And some of them are good and some of them are not as good. It depends on what type. It depends on what type you are. For an example, like this QQ bang level 5 right here. Which I think this is towards melee attack and um stamina as well. For like, It's probably like for a Namek race. And uh, once again, my computer in the background. But but yes, this this QQ QQ bang is probably useful for the Namek race and for an, and this example right here. This this one would probably work for Majin male if you are a melee type. And this one right here it should be also a melee type as well but your key is gonna go all the way down and your stamina is almost all the way down and then this one as well is also strike super so I mean if you like strike supers and all that good stuff that's definitely a melee character as well now this QQ bang right here is for key type because health is high key is higher but your stamina is all the way low Basic attacks low, strike supers is low, and key blast supers are up. And this one is the one I'm using right now is kind of like this one, but it's um because I have a lot of stamina, so I was like, eh, that's gonna bring it all the way down. So I was like, might as well use this one. And I feel like when I made this QQ bang the first time I made it, I'm like, this is like for key blast supers and strike supers. Like, you can be melee or key blast supers at the same time so i'm gonna show you guys how to make this right now but f but you need a couple of things before you do this so right now i am flying to the clothing shop and i have to show you what you need to buy at the clothing clothing shop because you basically need any clothes you like all right so basically all you need to find is Whatever what costume you wish to make as a level 5 QQ bang is you need to find a level 5 clothing like for this one for Namekian and for the 4 star Dragon Ball as well. As you can see I bought 4 of the 4 star Dragon Ball and also um, Beerus' clothes as well so I can show you this demonstration of the level 5 QQ bang. So right now I'm going to go to Capsule Corp right here and show you the level 5 QQ bang, how is it, some of the recipes are, um, properly made. Alright, so once you get to Capsule Corp, you will go to this place right here that is the clothing mixing shop. I hope you all getting this, I hope you all following me and not get lost like, oh my god, what is he talking about? So basically, once you have your level 5 clothes and stuff, you will come to the clothing mixing shop and you can make OP level 5 nice QQ bangs. So now, as you can see, I also have another level 5 um, um, costume as well. So, all you have to do is pick another level 5 um, clothes and then I pick Beerus' clothes, right? With the battle suit of Bardock. It tells you right here, are you going to add more items? So basically what that means, when you click yes for more items, it's going to show you capsules of which um, capsule you want to use. Like you want to use the aura crystal or use the region crystal. If you guys want to use the capsules to make an OP QQ bang, I recommend using the level 4 capsules, not the level 2 ones that says shape up drop level two i recommend the level four because it is a higher chance of giving you a level five qq bang and plus if you do add a sensu 
in there it should give you a level 5 QQ bank so I guess I could show that off real quick if not then it's a joke yep I was right so I was right here you go guys right here an OP QQ bang right there with Beerus's clothes and Bardock plus with the Sensu um the Sensu thing the one you make for the um revival Sensu beam and this is what I make for a level 5 QQ bang that actually does not look bad that does not look bad. That actually looks good. And then we do it again with um, level 5. You can actually combine it with the same clothes. Let's see what you get. But for the sake of this video, we're going to um, limit it. So you do have an option to press yes or no. If you press no, basically it's still going to give you a level 5 QQ bang. Because it's mixing two clothes together of their stats that was previous. And this one's not good either. This one's actually good too. Man, I may actually equip this on my character. This QQ Bang. Wait, never mind. It's Strike Supers I'm looking at. Oops. <laughs> but anyways, you can do it again. And it already gives you what it is. Apparently, it doesn't show that because it's mysterious. Now we're going to do this again with a capsule. See how the outcome will be. And we're going to use a level for shape up um shape up easy or that's how you pronounce it and i think it's gonna make my stats lower or higher if i'm not mistaken yeah it shapes up my stats a bit there's a level four so all right we have no more dragon ball actually yes we do all right now we're gonna do it again with a sensu bean I don't think I did that with a sensu bean, so now we're gonna do it again with a sensu bean. As you can see, this stuff does change as well, so you have to be careful of what different types of level five um clothing you use with a um mixture with a capsule, because once you have a capsule mixed with two level five um clothes plus with the sensu. It will probably make it something like this, what you're seeing right here. So that's probably something else. All right, I'll probably show off one more clothing. So we'll take the the last four star Dragon Ball and mix it with, eh, we'll try to find a higher clothes. Eh, Super 17, eh. See if I can find another level five clothes I have. Oh, I have Beerus's clothes, but I'm I think I'm wearing it. Yeah, I think I'm wearing it. I, my, I'm not mistaken. Oh, wait, no, no. I don't have enough money. <laughs> oh. All right. So, I guess we're going to use uh, the Great Saiyan man. So, we're going to press yes and we're going to use the antidote. Iso. So, we're going to use the antidote. Oh, that brings it lower, but that's not bad. It actually gets all the stats up. That's that's not bad. But anyways, guys, that's how you make an OP QQ bang so far. I know in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. So as you can see, as you guys saw witnessing live, I did said I was going to equip this because this actually does look nice. Even I know I have this one, which is a little bit more better, but my stamina is low. Plus, it'll make it lower as well. But yeah, guys, these are all the level 5 QQ bangs I've been making. I wish I wish I can send them to other players that need help with a higher QQ bang. So it can help them out a lot with their battles and everything. So I hope you guys think this video is helpful. If you think this video was helpful, don't forget to drop a like on it. It'll do me a big favor. And also, subscribe to the channel if you want more how-to tutorials of QQ bangs mixtures and stuff because I lost a lot of zinni from that but it was worth it to make all these um OP QQ bangs level 5 so hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to do me a huge favor drop a like on this video and also subscribe to the channel that helps me out a lot and I'll see you guys next time in the next Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 video.